The goals of treatment of a patient with ulcerative colitis are twofold. The first is to treat the acute exacerbation or attack of ulcerative colitis, and the second is to prevent future recurrences, or at least minimize those recurrences. Since this is an inflammatory bowel disease, the cornerstone of treatment of ulcerative colitis are anti-inflammatories. Ulcerative colitis may be treated with systemic anti-inflammatory medications, including corticosteroids. It may also be treated with topical anti-inflammatory medications. This is because the inflammation in ulcerative colitis is limited to the lining cells of the large intestine, and so applying an anti-inflammatory directly to those lining cells is effective in treating ulcerative colitis. Aminosalicylates are an example of topical anti-inflammatory medications that are effective in treating patients with ulcerative colitis. Since this is a disease that involves the immune system, medications that modulate the immune system are also effective in treating ulcerative colitis. Immune modulating medications such as 6-MP or azathioprine are helpful in quieting the immune response in patients with inf inflammatory bowel disease in general and ulcerative colitis in particular and are effective in treating these patients. Lastly, surgery. Surgery is very important to understand because surgery is curative in patients who have ulcerative colitis. Although it seems drastic, it is important to remember that surgery removes the entire colon and therefore removes any problems that may be associated with ulcerative colitis. So a patient who has ongoing bleeding that is very severe may be best treated with colectomy or removal of their colon. Ulcerative colitis is also associated with a long-term risk of colon cancer and surgical removal of the colon eliminates the risk of colon cancer in patients who have long-standing ulcerative colitis.